What are you doing foaming us? We're just on a stage, it's set up on the beach and there's loads of girls and they go mad for the dancers. There was loads and loads of kids there just loving it. You were like, yeah, this is a girls day then on the beach. Seven songs in Newcastle are about to get on a helicopter to go and do seven songs in the cricket at the cricket in Nottingham. One thing I've always refused to do, they say you need to get a helicopter from here to here. And I'm like, I can't, please don't make me do it, I can't do it, I can't do it. And Tash has done helicopters, Jen's done helicopters, but I can't. As a band, we've never done them because I'm just like, please, anything but a helicopter. We pulled up. I remember getting out of the car and just going, oh. Nervous? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Turn in the window. We're in the helicopter now, we're about to take off and we're on our way to Nottingham to go and do the cricket final. When you take off, it goes like that and it goes... <sighs> well, the best bit about being in a helicopter, when you get off... London's even better! Don't! Just stop! Actually, I really enjoyed it in the end. In the end, it was just really cool. I was a bit nervous at the beginning, but absolutely really, really boss. Very good. So I might pop out and get one at the weekend. Huh? We've got such a wide fan base. Sometimes we get surprised. <laughs> we had to do this cricket gig the half time before the final we were on, and it was all sportsmen. It was hardly any girls or kids there. It's a good change to go from lots of teenagers to adults. It just changes the dynamics of the day a bit, and it makes it a lot more interesting. They've been going for five years in that time. They chalked up a string of number ones and have been on sellout tours. They are simply one of the best all-girl groups around and one of Britain's biggest bands on the music scene today. Please give it up for Lil, Tash and Jenny. It's Atomic Kitchen! It was a bit daunting getting on stage, but we had a really good reception. The audience there was mostly men because every time we just like did anything to be like yay! We just sort of played up to the lads to make the crowd a bit more crazy. See at the last gig there was lots of young girls so every time the boys came on there was huge screaming. This gig there was lots of sports fans so men mostly and every time the boys came on there was a lot of booing. So a bit of a difference to what happens tonight. And then we went to Silverstone to do a huge Formula One show. Oh, bit of a posh gang, isn't it? Mm -hmm. It was black tie, big posh tables, like in a, on a big plush meal. We're here in Stowe School and we're doing um, a big showbiz bash thing for the Grand Prix, British Grand Prix. 
and we're performing seven songs tonight. Craig Dave was also on. Willy Wonka. And um, we're getting ready in a library of all places, and it's like Harry Potter. Quite homely to me, actually. I mean, I'm used to surroundings like this. At school. Go wild, go crazy to hear for you tonight. Atomic Kitten! Everyone was slightly tipsy by the time we got to perform. It's probably about one, two in the morning. But, you know, that made the reception that we got even bigger and it was just an absolutely fantastic gig. Everyone enjoyed themselves that day, everybody. And it include us. Teenagers having fun on the beach, to loads of lads watching cricket, to like loads of people in black tie. That day really came home to us how many different types of people are Atomic Kitten fans and it was really cool.